Hello everyone, welcome to One Stop Mathematical Solutions. Today we are going to see a lot of useful results uh, on the number of functions that can be used for CSA or RGATE exams. Okay, the first result is before that take two sets A and B and the number of elements in A B M and the number of elements in B B N. Okay, and F B a function from A to B. The first result is for m greater than n. The total number of 1 to 1 maps is 0. And the total number of on to maps is given by a formula n power m minus nc1 n minus 1 power m plus n c 2 n minus 2 power m minus n c 3 n minus 3 power m and it goes on third one is the total number of bijective functions are zero because there is no one-to-one -one function here okay the second case is for m less than n then the total number of on to maps will be zero and the total number of one-to-one -one maps will be n c m into m factorial then the total number of bijective functions will also be zero because there is no onto function here right the third case is when the cardinality of both sets are equal m equal to n in this case the total number of one to one functions is n factorial and the total number of onto functions is also n factorial and the total number of is also n factorial now the uh, important thing to notice if a has m elements and b has n elements and how many functions can be formed between a and b okay this is given by modulus of b power modulus of a the cardinality of b power cardinality of a which is n power m okay don't mug up only the n power m because if they just change this is n or this is m you will be confused okay so always uh, have it in mind that it is cardinality of b power cardinality of a thank you see you next time